oxygen 30 percent what is going on guys welcome back to occupy mars Right, um, let's just switch our water bottles back out. We're going to get some funky music while we do so. Um, we're going to hit up this bottle, that bottle first. Um, because we're going to be close to the rover, what I'll do is I'll put that bottle back in there. It's a little bit used, but it's only been used overnight. Uh, right, but we're going to head straight back out. Actually, we're going to also grab a... Um, once that opens, we're going to grab ourselves a repair kit. Just so we've got one on us. And we can actually head back out here and start grinding down the rest of this stuff. But uh, yeah, hope everybody is doing well. I uh, hope everybody's having a good week in, so far. It's, uh, hopefully it's a short week like mine. Uh, if not, you're halfway through the week. Uh, welcome. <laughs> um, for me, it's a short week because it's only a four-day work week. So I think I'm actually now getting uh, hit with thirst. Yeah, we are. Okay, so let's switch those two around. And uh, you know what, I'll go put that back in the rover just because we're done over here anyway. So we're going to loop back around. And what we'll do is I'll just move that water bottle over there and I'll move this one over there now. So then we've got a spare water bottle on us all the time. But uh, yeah, I've got, um, I've got some plans uh, for the next few weeks. So um, hopefully I'm going to get back to streaming again. Um, this week's a short week, so um, no. Um, so hopefully I've been streaming this week uh, back again. Um, it's hopefully Tuesday is not going to be a bad day. Um, I really do want to play Battlefield uh, again. Um, like the few times I played it recently, uh, like we played it a little bit in um, a little bit on New Year's, uh, New Year's Eve, to New Year's Day. Um, if you guys came out and watched that, or if you missed it, I apologize. But um, yeah, it was actually a really good stream. I actually really enjoyed it. I played it then a few months later. Or I played it, I think it was sometime in February, I think. Um, or later in January. I can't really remember. I think it was maybe it was in February. Um, and then I haven't streamed since. Um, and then I think I streamed Call of Duty and stuff on that same week. And then I got really unwell. Um, but yeah, that, that is going to change a lot um, relatively soon. Um, I'm hoping to get... Um, I'm hoping to get everything up and running again. So if you guys are interested in that, please do come and even even if you go follow, it's free if you make an account. Uh, make an account also free. Um, come and follow me over on Twitch. Um, help me get partnered over there as well. Um, I'm actually getting really close to my uh, goal as well uh, here on YouTube. Uh, my next goal here on YouTube is actually... Um, it's actually like 5,000 subs. Uh, sorry, 5,500 subs, sorry. Uh, we're getting there. Um, we're really, really getting there. We're almost there. Um, I think I've only got like 50 to go. Um, like I'm counting you guys down. Uh, so if you guys haven't subscribed yet, please do consider just making an account. Click on subscribe. It's free to do so. Um, you can make it with a throwaway email if you want. Um, just... Help me get to that goal. Um, I'm not sure what I'm going to do once I get to that goal. Uh, I don't really have any sort of like plans or anything like that. Um, really, it's just a goal for me to get to. Um, and I'm so close. Like so, so close. And it would mean a lot to me as well, guys. If you actually, uh, if you haven't hit subscribe already, just hit subscribe. If you don't want to watch the content or anything, just subscribe if you've got an account. And then you can sort of just forget about me if you want. <laughs> I'm just trying to, uh, I'm just trying to reach a goal. Like, I think 500 and 1,000 subs has actually been my goal for a long time. So, um, and now that I'm so close to one of them, I really want to get there. Like, uh, like the growth on this channel has actually been crazy in the last, uh, the last sort of, a sort of year actually. Um, like I haven't well the growth right now though is actually a lot better than before um so thank you guys uh thank you guys for subscribing uh thank you guys for watching even uh, and thank you for letting me do the thing i like to do uh really 
it obviously motivates me more as well when you guys like subscribe and stuff like that so um if you wouldn't if you would kindly like to uh to hit subscribe um cost you guys nothing you guys just need to make an account that's all that's it I need to go switch out those boxes we're now full yeah because you guys nothing at all to subscribe and uh yeah um once we hit that goal i think i can create like like members and stuff like that or something i am um, i haven't actually read up on it but, um yeah i'm sure i can make like some cool like emojis or something like that which uh you guys can yeah i think i don't know i don't i know like um the channels I watch have like uh, members and stuff like that like where you get like early access to like videos like if, I don't know if it's like a monthly subscription or something but you guys can pay to get access to the videos earlier I might do something like that where I, I don't know I might pull out like a two two videos a day or something and then just uh, give you guys access to a day early or something I don't know I'll figure it out once we get there. If we get there. I think we will. We're close. We're going to make it in the month of April. Definitely. I think to uh, 500. It'll be nice to get there. Please. If you guys don't mind. <laughs> that subscribe button like on the video as well if you liked it i know i always say i like the end of a video but uh, i think i i lose out on a lot of it because i don't say at the, like the beginning of the video i think a lot of people use uh, lose interest before the end but um yeah i'm like some of you guys don't really like this type of content so some of you guys are going to miss out on some good stuff so i'm going to have to repeat myself in a later video probably tomorrow's actually i'll probably have to repeat a few bits what i've said in the last uh last two i think this is the last day we're going to be out there we're heading home today anyway we're homebound oh that laptop what type of laptop is it can't tell Judging by the keypad, I would guess Adele. Also an American keyboard as well. I'm pretty sure. Because on the British keyboards, you've got a big enter button. I think on the American, you don't. I think it's like a small enter button. I don't really like them. Some people in the UK who get them and it's like... Ugh. You're like a proper UK keyboard. <laughs> and like some of you guys are from like Europe as well. So um, I think when you get like uh, keyboards like that, you uh, you get American style ones. The American style ones are awful. I don't like them. The keyboards, not the Americans. <laughs> uh, right here we've got some popular. We've got more popular. Um, what we got here? Steel plates. Am I full on steel plates again? Yeah, I am. Alright, we'll go throw those in the back. While we can. But, uh, yeah, I think what we'll do is we'll probably clear out up here and then we'll, uh, we'll head home. Uh, so B and G. Right, I guess what we'll do is we'll probably actually just go over here and what we'll do is we'll keep an eye in this area for whatever we can find. If we can see the um, the point of interest. So what we'll do is we'll go external just to see if I can see anything on the face of it. So it might pop up and I might just go, oh, we need to go there. I might see like a, I don't know, like a mountain range or something with like a, a something. I don't know. We already found the roadster. We found aliens. 
Actually, I should really call those episode aliens. God damn it. I missed out. <laughs> New location discovered. Endeavor. Nope, not seeing anything on the surface anyway. Right. All stop. Let's go outside and let's go start grinding down this place. And just because it's easier to grind exterior stuff outside, we'll uh, we'll use the tier three grinder. Which I just realised we're not even like halfway through this episode yet, and and we're going home today as well. I can't believe I've actually like been out here almost like three days. Well, actually, been more than three days. How many days have we been out here now? So we done. We're going to be doing today and a bit of tomorrow. So that's about one and a half days. We did all day yesterday, which is two, three and a half days. Like four days we've been out, which is not too bad actually. Really, when you think about it, like we could do longer, but. Uh, I know this is not the type of content for everybody, so we will be heading home and go and doing something else. I've, I've got a couple of ideas I want to do. I want to try and get um, try and get nuclear power up and running. Might even move the um, like the water production like solely to uh, nuclear power. I think it'll be a good idea. The water for yeah i think that actually be really good actually if we can get like all the water to like nuclear power then what we'll do is we'll move the uh two nuclear reactors we've got now somewhere else but yeah they'll just get like pared down and rebuilt somewhere else we've got the heavy suit now as well so radiation i don't think is a huge deal anymore i think radiation before was a deal but uh, right now it's not I like one of you guys was like worried about me um having the uh reactors that close to the base and stuff. Oh didn't quite shift uh, control click that. I think I I think my finger hit the shift button instead of the uh, actual control button there. Yeah we're we're nicely uh getting a lot of materials this is going to help us out a boat ton when we get back home right uh let's just clean out the exterior of the base first usually i do the exterior last but that's fine <clears throat> but yeah i'm hoping to maybe try and get a few more bases done today so we're not going to grind down the inside we're just going to loot the insides So, just like sort of tidy up the exterior, because we get a lot of um, components and small pipes and electronics, glass plates, solar cells, etc. From this, pretty much. Solar cells, I'm not really too fussed about, but we can always recycle those for extra materials now. So we can get like the base material out of them. I think it'll be a good thing. Wow, we're only we're just over five thousand meters away now as well very nice yeah, this is the last thing right what we'll do is i'm just gonna loot the inside i'm gonna put the grinder away and we'll just loot uh we are thirsty but not too thirsty all right big these things i will grind down just because it's easier to grind them down than it is trying to get things out of them Also, it seems like they fixed a lot of the, um, like, the stuff we're picking up not going under the bases anymore. It used to be, um, a huge thing. It sometimes used to happen in, uh, previous, um, 
Like, even earlier on, like, uh, I think, uh, like, I'm looking down at the ground now, I'm pressing Z, I'm not seeing anything below ground. Now, uh, if you press Z, it actually does highlight where all of the cool stuff is. It, it does show you where all these are as well, but, um, yeah, it, it doesn't take, uh, it expires, um, as well, not very long of a time. But okay, I use it just to speed things up. My inventory is full. Oh, I think this is full also, isn't it? No, it doesn't. We put a new one in. Good. Okay, we're good. Always pick up the circle pods. They're always good. It means we can build more stuff later on. We need them. Right, okay. We are done in this place. Right. We're leaving. Moving on to the next. What we'll do is we'll, uh, we'll unload our inventory here a bit because uh, it's getting a little full. Right, looks like we've got some more pipes. Got some more calcium. What else we've got here? We've got the aluminium plates. There's my aluminium plates there. So we've got another set of those. Right, we'll go put those in the back of the uh, rover. Right now, I think we would actually filled up that uh, inventory space. Um, why well, we've got this big space back here. Right, so what we'll do is we'll quickly mark this as being in grinded. Oop, press space instead of B. G. Right, um, I want to go up there as well, but... Uh, We've got like three down here, so I'm thinking hit this one, this one, this one, this one, and then head back. Um, I think we'll be good. We, we are going back tomorrow, though. Mm. You know what? We'll go up here and we'll grab this one. Just because I think I've got enough time to do it all. I think I've got enough time to do it all. Mm, big crater there. Someone's hit here at some point. trying to see if this is like a potential spot where uh, where this name location is or, so, or where the point of interest is if we don't find it what I'll do is I'll probably mark it and then what we'll do is uh, in a future episode we might actually come around and uh, start looking for some point of interests actually so maybe it's me, uh, what I'll do is actually maybe it's in between episodes or something I might just go around and just uh, Mark all of the points of interest in our in our map, just so I know where they all are. Ooh, it looks like we've got a lot of grind and what needs to be done here. This should, well, actually this shouldn't be too bad. Okay, critical usually means I'm out of water. Have a look. Yeah, I'm out. Okay, let's uh, switch out water bottles for a new one. Oh, oxygen's starting to get low, but I think we're good. Yeah, we're good for a little while longer yet. Alright, let's start grinding this stuff down. Let's get this stuff done. We should be able to get this base done today, I think. I think we should be able to get another three on the way home done tomorrow. Then we should make it back. Might make it back a bit late, actually. But to be fair, we've actually done quite nicely. I think we sort of like zigzagged around, but we're not too far away from home. We're only like 5,000 meters away. Which is not really too far at all. We're just past the... Uh, it's 15% oxygen, so I, well, I might just switch out our oxygen tanks. I think we're okay for now. I think it, I think it'll warm me out 10 and then 5. Should be good though. Like we, we won't run out. I'll make sure we won't. I'll, uh, I'll keep an eye on it. But yeah, let's get all these bases grind down, and then we'll. Uh, 
without heading home. If I have to, I'll just stay up all night. And not sleep. To be honest with you, I don't think it's going to take me that long to grind down this one. I think getting the last three down there, which I want to get, I think I'll be able to get easily. Yeah, we should be able to. It's not even dark yet, really, is it? This tier 3 grinder we should be okay, right? I think. Other than these two here, I think we've got everything. I'm just keeping an eye on that bomb left in the suit or two. Once it gets down to about... The O2 on at least the about the beginning of the uh, the O in between the O and the two. That's when I need to start switching out my oxygen tank. To be fair, I don't usually let it get this low. I'm just letting it run lower because um, well, it takes a while for it to empty anyway. I'm just gonna go in here. It's easier. All right, so looks like we've got some seeds here. Grabbing the seeds because we can. Oh, on button. Nothing else in here, no. No. Okay, looks like we've got a big circuit board in here. Some screws there. Anything else in here? Nope. I've got some there, look, which I'm just about missed. Medium circuit board. Upstairs, see if there's anything up here. Let's see, that's where our tablet is. A med kit. Not seeing anything else. Oh, that thing's actually really folded up, that lamp. Right. Um, let's set our, our inventory. I uh, just thought it's nice and tidy. And the rest can go. In the rover. Right, go. I actually parked really far away. Didn't need any other stuff there, wasn't there? Right, let's empty this out quickly. So you, you, and you. Right, let's go. Mark this as being ingrained. Thank you so. Right. Uh, let's head over here next. So we should be able to hit one. I think it was like, uh, what I'm going to do though, so I'm just going to mark this as a point of interest. Uh, name. Point of interest. Uh, icon of that. So we've got it. Right, let's go. What we'll do is we'll just loop around the base here. Use that as a roundabout. Wrong side of a road roundabout for me in the UK, but a roundabout nonetheless. <laughs> yeah, we are nearly halfway through the episode. And we've actually done quite a lot, actually. We've, um, we've ground down a lot of bases. We've got a lot of materials. I shouldn't need to worry about materials for a while. Um, I've not really got many plans for it, though. Not yet, anyway. Right, so let's... Stop off here. Also, just having a look at the time there as well. It's actually getting really late. My voice is starting to, uh, to croak out as well. Why well, I'm not talking as much. <laughs> Gotta get really warm in this room though while I'm in. Do 
be fair, my actually uh, my GPU's actually uh, not really spooled up that much today, even though it's been warm out. Just hope when I go to bed, my, uh, my bed's going to be nice and cool. Nothing worse than going to bed and it's being red hot. No way, I'm not looking forward to the summer months. <laughs> I don't really like the summer months, especially here in the UK. It actually gets really, really warm. Like our houses are designed to keep the heat in, because it's supposed to be cold during the winter months, uh, or at least it's supposed to be cold anyway. Um, so our homes are designed to be like sort of hold the heat, but um, no. Right below 10%, right? That's as low as I want to go. That's as low as I would like to go. Right, I'm just going to see this right here. So we've got, just to double check, 21 and 10. And that should now be 22 and 10. Yep. That is the, so we're currently eating the meals we're picking up. But we shouldn't really be. Should be eating the big meals which I'm making. I think that's what they are. The, the other ones. Yeah, that's everything here done. Right, let's do over here. Work into the night here a bit. As it gets dark enough, I'll um I'll turn on the MVGs again. I want to know your guys' opinion on the MVGs actually. Do you think they're good? Do you think they're bad? What do you think they look like on YouTube? Does it look good? Does it look bad? You don't want me to use them? Do you want me to use this instead? Let me know. I love watching the stars though at night in this game. Like I could literally just like lie back and then just do that. I wish the uh, the model the Milky Way a bit better though. I don't know if that uh, is actually modeled off of our sky or not. Oh, the Martian sky. I'm not even sure. Right, MVG's time. Everything is turning green. I don't know why they just didn't go with them um, with white MVGs. Why did they go with green? There's different colors of MVGs, so if you guys didn't know. You guys are probably going to tell me about all of our MVGs now. <laughs> just I mentioned something like that, you guys are just like, uh, you guys like to tell me a lot of information, which I love. I really do. I thought my screen just changed there next to me. Oh, it did, that's why. <laughs> I've got like a, um, well, there's a TV sent to the left of me. And uh, the screen changed. I was wondering why. It just switched on while it was uh, playing. Right, okay, so... Let's head inside and see what we can see. I'll see what we can find, even. Got another couple of hours left of... Uh, what we've got to go sleep. Which, to be fair, we might not do anyway. That's good. I think what we'll do is, I'm just going to put these in here if I can. How much space has this got left? Okay, it's full. So we've got another one in here. Medium. Okay, we've got one on the floor in there. I'm actually trying to get used to my uh, original mouse again. Um, I've been using it uh, back for a week now. I haven't actually used my little wireless mouse I got. Uh, I'm just mainly going to be paired with my laptop when I get it. I haven't actually got it yet. Um, I'm actually excited for it though. It shouldn't be too much longer away. Now. Hopefully. Right, anyway. Let's um, start unloading stuff. 
Wow, well, seriously, superpowers only go down to 75% now. Wow, okay. Uh, what we'll do is we'll just trade you out, move you over though. Alright, so I'll put you guys in here. Move you in there, move you in there. Looks like we've got another bunch of uh, small pipes. Um, Alright, I guess we'll go throw those in the back quickly. And then we'll, uh, we'll start heading over to our next destination. I'm just going to go in there for now. Loads of materials. Right, okay. Um, right, where are we going? We need to go to... Do, 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 do. I'm just going to hit tab just in case I accidentally hit something I shouldn't, like, uh, remove my helmet. Um, there's nowhere I want to be. I want to be in here. There we go. Alright, I guess what we'll do is... There's another point of interest there, look. What I'll do is I'm just going to name it... Point of interest. Uh, we're just going to... You hit that. Yeah, there we go. Right, I think what we'll do is... Yeah, I think we can hit these three and then head home, I think. Yeah, we should be able to do that, right? Okay, so I think what we'll do is we'll start heading down here. And then the rest of them will hit on the way. So this one's only 900 meters away, so it's not too far. But we are heading further away from home. <laughs> Almost at uh, five and a half. Sorry, 5,000 and a half meters away. That's all right. Uh, keep our camera external just in case I see something. Like a point of address we are in that area. If not, I will always come back. I know like you can find like the uh, like rovers and stuff, but uh, I'm not seeing anything. It's usually easier to see during the day as well, so I think we will come back out eventually and uh, come and see if we can find some points of interest. Slowly moving the camera around. See if we can see anything. No. Alright, once we get here we'll uh, we'll sleep. And then we'll crack on in the morning. Sleep until about 6 a.m. Now I'll take a quick sip of my drink as well. My voice is starting to get a little bit uh a little bit gone. That's fine, I've been recording for three hours. Nearly, I'm five minutes shy of three hours. Right, okay, so we'll just come to a stop. Space the rover this way though. Right, that'll do me. Right, MVGs can come off. And do we need any water bottle or anything? No, we might actually be all right with this. Nope. Yes, yes, we will. Yes, we will. We're fine with that. Right. Um, let's sleep. I'm going to take a sip of my drink while we sleep, though. Gives me time for a break. Right, welcome break is now over. Let's head out and gr start grinding things down now, shall we? I think what I'm going to need though is just I'm going to probably end up grinding everything down. We're going to need one of those, at least one. Right. Let's start, shall we? This shouldn't take us too long. And then we'll run around and try and loot everything and then we'll Start heading home. Today is home day. Quite literally. I almost started singing a song there, saying we uh, I can't remember what it's called. We're going home. Tell the world that we're going home. I'm coming home. Or whatever it is. I don't even remember the lyrics. It's late. Give me a break. I'm coming home. That's it. 
Well, I'm coming home by somebody, I don't remember who. <laughs> yeah. I now want a helmet. It's now stuck in my head. <laughs> who knows? I might even uh, name this episode I'm Coming Home. Question mark. <laughs> It's only half seven in the morning and we're uh, already well cracking on. I just need to come up with a game plan for the next... Uh, I think I've got a game plan for like the next couple of episodes. So uh, I think what we'll do is when we get back, it won't be today, but uh, well, we'll get back today. Um, I think what we'll do is we're going to do, um, we're going to start getting rid of some solar panels. Let's start putting in some, uh, some big boys, some nuclear powered stuff. The thing is though, I don't even know what happens with the panels now. Like, um, we're going to keep them obviously. I like to have more than one form of power generation just in case something goes wrong always good to have more incomes than you need type of thing you should never know if you're going to need it and what happens if one of our um, nuclear arrays gets hit for instance with a meteor it wipes out all of our meteor st uh, of our nuclear stuff and then we are screwed <laughs> We have no forms of power, so yeah, it's always good to have like at least two forms. Um, we're going to do solar plus um, solar plus um, plus wind. There is two forms of power there, just in case one of them gets hit for whatever reason. We've got a backup. Also, we've got a backup in case we have a meteor strike and it wipes out of our nuclear stuff and. Um, and then we get a sandstorm. It means we can rebuild our nuclear while our wind protects us, or at least the wind will keep us going for a sort of short period of time. At least then during like the sandstorm we're gaining power type of thing. Because our solar panels ain't gaining diddly squat. To be fair, we haven't actually cleaned them. Um, it'd be nice to see what our base percentages are at once we uh, reach home. See if we're uh, we're all right on power. We should be. We should more than be all right on power. To be fair. Oh, there we go. My PC fans are kicking in. Oh, my GPU got warm. I just looked over there and it was um, high 80s, almost 90. No wonder the GPU fan kicked in. To be honest with you, it only kicked in for a few seconds and it dropped it below 80. <laughs> the joys of having a clean GPU fans. Always keep your GPU fans clean, by the way. I think the same thing with um, my radiator in, because uh, I have an um, all-in-one cooler uh, for the CPU. Um, always keep your radiator clean and your fans clean on that as well. The only thing with my PC... Oh, there you go, it's kicking back on again. I don't know what it's kicking on for because... Uh... Oh, there we go, it's peaking. At 95. There you go, it's now below 80. <laughs> <laughs> Getting a little bit warm. Um, the way my uh, case laws for um, everything is um, my f um, my CPU uh, heat technically goes into the case which then heats the case a little bit but um, not the best way of doing it but uh, it's fine it works a lot of people are like oh yeah you don't want your GPU flowing into your uh, Blowing into your uh, so your CPU blowing into your case, which then heat up your graphics card, which then you, you know you push the heat back into your 
into your case, which then increases the heat in the CPU. To be honest with you, it, it doesn't really matter that much. Like, um, to be honest with you, um, I've had no issues. Even during like the hot summers and stuff, um, I tend to keep my case clean, or as clean as I can. I clean it about like a few times a year, which uh, if you guys uh, don't clean your PCs every now and again if you're playing games on your PCs, because uh, take it this way, it, it gets full of dust and then you know your performance tanks. So, a little friendly neighborhood reminder to clean your PCs out. Keeps them cool. Keeps them operating well. You'll thank me for it later. Trust me. Even though, like, even if you, like, get on a laptop or something like that, like a gaming laptop, at least, uh, you know, like, uh, blow the fans out every now and again. You won't... Honestly, you really don't know how much it actually helps. Okay, my inventory's full. Oh, the next six hours, great. Right, I'm going to come back for you, just in case I need you, but uh, yeah, the next six hours is fine. Hopefully we'll be on our way home by then. Oh, I could have put you in. Uh, apples can go in there, you can go in there. So it looks like we've got electronics and steel plates again, they're full. Uh, so electronics, steel plates, they can go on the back. Alright, I'll go grab that one last pack of seeds, then we'll get out of here. Having more seeds than I need is always great. Who knows what they are, but we'll grab them. Might as well. Alright, we're out of here. Alright, what we'll do while we're here, we'll just uh, put in this one being grinded and we'll nicely move on to the next one. Which is going to be over here. So I think in the next six hours, we'll get both of these guys grinded down and we'll be heading home in a sandstorm. Which is going to be fun. There we go, we get some beats. Right. Head to the next one. Now we're gonna be started heading towards home. We're now decreasing that distance. Two buildings left. Once we get back we'll start um refilling everything. Getting things ready. Back our next trip. I think to be honest with you, like we've got plenty of water bottles and everything now. Any extras we'll just get rid of. Right, what I'll do is I'm gonna park here. Oh, let's get to grinding. We've got so many hours until the sandstorm comes in. This thing it shouldn't take us too long at all. Now we're fighting up the sandstorm right now. Grinding things down in the sandstorm is going to be way too hard, so I think uh, we'll probably just start heading home at that point. Also, our hydration's getting a little low, but I haven't had any hydration warnings yet, so. And plus, we're not playing the music saying that we're really desperately thirsty either, so. Good. Grab these boxes. 
hopefully the sandstorm shouldn't be too bad. I'm thinking about going hitting the uh, the signal, but oh, there we go. Thinking about dehydration. <laughs> Some cables there as well. I missed. Full tool condition, fine. We've got a repair kit ready for it. 333, nice. Warning. Tool condition. Ooh, not close enough. Just trying to move my head's because it's starting to uh, hurt my ear a little bit, but it's uh, one thing, and I was sitting down for too long. doesn't really work for me. I think uh, we had a conversation about this before where I want a new chair, but I'm waiting until... Yeah, there's uh, a couple of things I want to get first before I start buying a new chair. There's a couple of years until I can actually start even upgrading my PC. To be fair, the PC is still quite beasty. Just that the, the graphics card's a little bit on a couple of generations behind now. But it handles all the games I want to play very well. I'm playing this on Ultra, by the way. Everything's on Ultra. Everything's maxed out. Everything is maxed out in this game. I think that's the last uh, base we're going to over there, actually. So we've been here. We're now up against like the sandstorm, so I'm trying to go as quickly as I can. Of course it's not. It nope, we're not repairing out of the workshop table. Incoming sandstorm. Incoming Weather in the next three hours. Okay, we've got three hours. We're not going to go for the signal, by the way. I don't think it's worth it at this point in time. For the stuff that we're going to get from it. I know roughly what we get from them. Not really worth it. To be honest with you, if we're inside this base, we should be fine anyway. In the sandstorm, but uh, oh, oxygen bottle, I'll take that. Take this. Take that. And this one. Yep. Anything else? No. Nope. Some in there as well in the uh, airlock. Grab that before I go. Okay, I've got everything on this floor. Let's go upstairs. My lights in my room are just turned off, which means it's uh, past midnight. <laughs> Inventory full. full. I take it this is now. Nope. And tablets can't go in. And right, I'm oh, good. Hydration critical. Hydration. Okay, switch those around. Right, which was the one with the this way? Right, let's see if we can make it over to the next one before the sandstorm rolls in. Otherwise, we'll want to maybe have to have to wait it out inside of the rover. How many spaces is that? Okay, that's, that's full. Uh, looks like I'm done on solar panels again. And small pipes. Right, so what we'll do is we'll go throw those in the back. Rest can go up front. Uh, you can go in there. You can go in... Yeah. Um, you can just go in there for now. Uh, actually, what I'll do is I'll actually pull those out, switch those around. Uh, you can go in there. 
Right. In the next hour. Okay, yeah, we're done here. Uh, what we'll do is I'll mark that up when the sandstorm's in. We'll come over here and we'll try and start grinding down as much of this as humanly possible as the sandstorm rolls in. Might have to just live it out in this. Maybe sign out some inventory stuff. This just seems like there's quite a lot here, so. Yeah, there's quite a lot here. Alright, what we'll do is we'll go inside and we'll go loot everything first. Okay, there's this out over here we'll grab. Anything else outside by the looks of it? No. Let's see anything anywhere. More bottle, another one. Or a big circuit board. Looks like there's something there outside. We'll grab that. There's something there as well. I think I can just get out like that. There's our band tablet. There's some over here as well. Right. Well, I guess what we'll do is we'll grind this down and we'll head inside while the sandstorm's rolling. We've got a couple of seconds anyway. We'll grab what we can. It's on the hour, so it's going to be at 1500. We've got a few seconds to get in. All right. Get in. Lock up. Oxygen source external. Here comes the sandstorm. Sandstorm imminent. Find shelter. Warning. Right. Now we sort out our inventory and stuff. So, uh, how much room have we got in this? Okay. So this is full. Right. Okay. So what we'll do is we'll sit in this because this lets the time tick by while we're in it. Uh, so what we'll do is we'll pull you out there. And what we'll do is you're full, correct? Yes. So you can go back over there. And we'll grab this one out. Uh, oh, big circle board. It's actually damaged. Uh, water can go uh, there for now. This one can get switched out with this one. We're actually almost out of water anyway. So, yeah, we need to start heading back. Um... Everything else seems to be fine. We're good. We've got a new message that's probably a uh, signal. You know what, what we'll do is we'll just see where it is. I just want to see how far away it is. 1800 meters that way. Should we? Like 10 minutes. Should we? You know what? Just because it's not too far away, I might just do it. Yes, yeah, screw it. You know what? We're waiting for the sand sample to pass anyway. We'll do it. Um, we've got like 10 minutes as well. So, uh, right. Okay, so what we'll do is we'll BNG this. Uh, and then what we'll do is we'll mark this one up. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to BNG this one as well. Just so it's already done. Right, let's go. Go for the signal. Right, actually, before we go any further, lights. Just because it's incredibly hard to see during a sandstorm. I'm not sure if the lights are flickering there. No, they're not. It looks like the lights are flickering. I think it's just the sandstorm. The only thing is, I can't actually see anything like three feet in front of me. It's incredibly hard to see. MVGs help. Oh, MVGs help a lot, look. I can actually see a lot further with MVGs on. I see something over there as well, like Glowing. What is that? Out of base. 
We've got like nine minutes to get over there. MVGs help out so much. Also the lights to help him see in front of us as well. So we'll leave those on. We've got nine minutes to get there. Once we've been there, got it, we'll turn around and go back. We'll make it. I think. Hopefully. Looks like it's up on top of a hill here, though. I'm actually flying right now as well. <laughs> this thing actually hauls when you actually need to get somewhere fast. Oh, there goes the frame rate. Gonna have to stop. There we go, we're good. Loading chunks is a killer in this game. Especially if you're on ATV. So dangerous. It's six. 600 meters, nearly. There you go, 600 meters. Also trying to keep her on some sort of flat ground. We've got like seven and a half minutes to get that right. Okay, we need uh, uh, diff lock. Diff lock. Diff lock. There we go. By the way, we're going, we'll be lying at it back as well, by the way, to go finish off that base. <laughs> Actually starting to get late at night as well. We're going back to finish off that base. Uh, it might be in tomorrow's episode, though. We might be heading back tomorrow. That's fine. I wanted to go back today, but... Tomorrow's fine too. We'll head back or start heading back anyway. How many meters are we away? Oh, quite far away actually. I think we're actually heading somewhat back towards home actually as well. Sleep A sleep depth. So the abandoned signal's right here in front of us. Right there. That box right there. There'll do. Go check it out. We've got a sea magazine of tomatoes. That was not really worth it. <laughs> there we go. Take the box as well. Right, okay. What we'll do is we'll turn around and start heading back towards the base we just came from. This. Achievement. MVG's off. What is this? This is really cool. Okay. Got like a power socket we can open. Crash ship. All right, that's cool. All right, well, I'm gonna actually mark this. I'm guessing this is what's in this place. Yeah, we've already marked this. Look. Uh, what I'm gonna do though is I'm gonna call this one crash. Eh, uh, no, let's not call it. Uh, call it crash and then ship. I'm just trying to think of something which is actually short so I remember what it is. Uh, right, we'll mark that, but what I'm going to do as well is I'm going to do from the list. Thank. We've got all these in here as well, so I should be able to find my crashed ship in here, I think. Uh, where's it at? All these need to go still. 
Find the winter rest and crash cave. Need to go, need to go cave. I think it's this one actually, because I don't think I actually saved the name. Oh, I did. Point of interest, point of interest. I don't see it. Right, what we'll do is we'll head back and we'll try and get that grind done today. We'll come back to this at some point. It should be in my list. But it's going to be hard to see out the damn window. Okay, we've got like a like nearly 2,000 meters to go back. It would be nice to see what we've just been through. If we've been through all of this, <laughs> like sand dunes for days. I'm guessing that's what that um, thing was anyway. It's marked on the map. So we can at least find it. That's really, really interesting. I really like finding things like that. That way it was like out the blue. Find. It's really cool though. It's a crashed ship. I'm not sure if we can find anything inside it. But we'll come back out. And we'll have a proper look. Right now we are trying to... Keep to what we're trying to do at the minute. Yeah, there's some point I think I've got a few points of interest I really want to go see as well so we'll probably do an episode out of it but we'll go check them out at least these ones in this direction I'm actually really excited that I've went this way actually I think I got an achievement for that as well by the way right, let's turn on the MVG so you guys can see what we're going through that's why we luckily we can't breach the front glass doesn't like to turn sometimes. Actually, do we still have diff, diff lock on? I think we do. We did. Yeah, we don't need that one anymore. Diff lock is probably not going to help with turning. Completely dark now. Not completely, yeah, well, it's quite dark to be fair. Right, let's head back over here. Right, where are we on for time? I think by the time we get back we should be able to grind everything down and then what we'll do is we'll probably sleep and then tomorrow we'll uh, we'll head home it's not going to take us too long to get there it's only like going to be five thousand meters away so we should be okay but yeah um before i end the episode as well um if you guys are enjoying the series please do hit like by the way um i know i don't say it enough early on before the end of the episode i say it a lot at the end of the episodes uh, not too much at the beginning. Um, but yeah, if you if you are liking the videos, please um, do smash the like button. It actually really does help out the channel and everything. And um, also hit subscribe if you haven't already. I'm going to repeat myself here in about four or five minutes time. But uh, yeah, I'm trying to squeeze it in before we get to that point. We're going to try and get over here and grind down the rest of the space. I think we'll grind down the rest of the base and then I'll call the call the episode there's only some solar panels and stuff so it's not going to be too bad we'll also eat and then we'll uh yeah tomorrow we're heading home we're homeward bound and we'll uh go and load and well i was going to say charge this thing up but uh yeah, we haven't really lost that much power surprisingly even though a suit battery really lasts a lot longer than i thought it was going to uh, all three of them, I should say. We'll double check that as well. Before the end of the episode. Anyway, we're here. Try and grind down all these solar panels and everything. That was a nice little couple of hour round trip. Righty. We'll grind this down. We'll start over here. Because we started over here before. Back out into the wilderness. I 
you can imagine like how um how much stuff you can get done as well like when you're playing as a group like, especially like if one of you's unlocked something as well what like you need to like progress like say like i don't know like say one of you's manages to get um like most of the elect like electricity line done first so you're going to be like on electricity duty you're building all of the stuff like now how they're going to do like things like say if i unlock um like say like solar panels and stuff like is it, is it like like well actually even another thing like what happens if somebody unlocks a solar panel but then the person who builds the solar panel has like um like upgraded solar panels too or whatever um but then say one of somebody else only has one upgraded solar panels one like how are you gonna balance that stuff out that, that's gonna be interesting once we get to that point in multiplayer anyway I was hoping to get back by now. <laughs> I was hoping to be home. But I decided to go after the abandoned signal. That's fine. We'll we'll grind down the rest of these and then we'll call it a day. I've been recording for three and a half hours now, so and it's um it's it, it's sort of like really late. I need to edit these videos as well tonight, so I'm going to be in it for the long haul. A couple more hours left for me. Yeah, we're almost done anyway. We're done by 1am, I think. In game time. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> There's a lot more solar panels here than I thought there was. And plus, with this thing, it doesn't really take too long. It takes... Uh, only seconds. Oh, five or six seconds to mine down one of these at a time? Yeah, it's going to be a little after one. What have we got left? Not many. Uh, two, four, including this one we're mining. We're grinding. Or scrapping, or whatever you want to call it. Right, this is the last one. That's going to be it for me. Right, let's head inside. Let's uh, close the door. Let's turn off our MVGs. And um, let's have a look at our inventory. Uh, our inventory is pretty okay, actually. We've got like... Uh, oh, actually, we've got some really full tomato seeds out of that. Um, right, so uh, we've got loads of engines as well, which uh, doesn't really matter anymore that we've got loads of them in our inventory. We'll just pop them in there for now. Right. Um, that's going to be it for me today. Um, hopefully you guys are still really enjoying these videos as much as I am. Um, because I'm actually really, really enjoying them. Uh, playing them and everything. So I'm just going to see if I can sleep until 6. Yes, I can. Okay, so yeah. Um, if you guys are enjoying it, please hit the like button. If not, there's that dislike button right next door. Please subscribe if you guys haven't already. Other than that, thank you guys again so much for watching. I'll see you guys all in the next one. What the fuck are you doing, Morgan? <laughs>